guys, my name is Mel. Welcome back. This is my video for my everyday look tutorial, I guess. I don't know. This is my everyday makeup, and this is the look that I'm going for, and I hope you enjoy it. So we're going to start with primer, and this is the Hangover Primer by Too Faced. I'm going to start putting this on my face. And then I'm going to put this Panda Dream Brightening Eye Base. Ooh, that looks scary. <laughs> I am going to put the Luminous Goddess Aura BB Cream. I got this at Tony Moly. Um, I think I shared it in one of my videos, the haul that I made. I put the link up down below and I put like a little drop of it. You don't need a lot. And then after I do that, and I'm using Makeup Forever, the HD High Definition Powder. Um, it's a translucent powder. And I just take my brush that all around my face. I like translucent powder. If you don't want to use like just regular powder, this is great. It's easy to travel with too. After that, I put on my blush. This is the Lorac Matte Buildable Blush. It's in cinematic. And then I take my angled brush right here. I'm gonna be kind of gentle with this because this is kind of, it's kind of, you know, heavy. Put that on my cheekbones. Yeah, for every day, I don't really contour my face, mainly because that's just a lot of makeup that I don't really wear. <laughs> or I need to wear, really. And I actually really, really like this blush too. It's a nice neutralish color. And then I highlight my face with the Crystal Marble Highlighter by Tolly Moly. And then I start on my eyebrows. <laughs> and I am going to use the Anastasia Brow with this Dip Brow Pomade in Chocolate. Have you ever find it very difficult to draw on your eyebrows? I have it. I have a really hard time doing this. It is never the same. One day it looks good, one day it doesn't. Now on to the eyes. <laughs> the eyes kind of take me the longest, mainly because uh, I have monolid eyes and can't really do a lot with them, so I try to make it as simple as possible, but fast. So I've been really into glitter eyeshadow, which is really strange because I think glitter is, ugh, it gets everywhere. So I really don't like using it. But surprisingly, I really like glitter eyeshadow. So I'm gonna start with the outer corners of my eye with this Laura Geller's Dark Brown. This I got as a gift. I don't know what this is called. This is called Atrium Mono Eyelid number 115 on the note. It's really pretty. Um, it goes on really light. It's a red burgundy color. I really like it. I got it as a birthday gift. So, from my cousin. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, this, this eyeshadow is great. It doesn't like go everywhere, which is kind of nice. I think you could get it online. I'm gonna try to put the link down all below of what I've been what I used. Alrighty. And then I take the blending brush like this and take the same brown I used on my other palette and I kinda just take this and put it on the corner of my eye and just kind of sweep it across and try to make it even. <laughs> Sometimes it doesn't come out even, and you know what? Oh well, mascara time. And I am going to use the better, the Too Faced Better Than Sex eyeshadow. Um, uh, mascara. It's not eyeshadow, it's mascara. I don't really wear eyeliner. I know it's a little strange that I don't use eyeliner with it, but I usually don't really wear eyeliner a lot, mainly because it takes too long to put it on. And then for my lips, usually I just kind of keep my natural lip color, or if I really want to, I put lip balm. And then I put I got NARS makeup in Niagara. Looks like this color. It's a pretty like salmon pinkish color. 
this is my everyday makeup. This is my makeup for every day. It's kind of awkward sharing this. I don't know. Anyways, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of this kind of video, let me know in the comments below or give it more of a thumbs up. Uh, if you liked it, share it. And please subscribe, please subscribe, please subscribe. Subscribe! And I'll see you next week. Bye!